Hello everyone, welcome. My name is Tisa and it's so great to have everyone here and I'm here right now and I'm looking into July the 23rd and the 24th is 2023 and this is for the fire signs. It's Aries, Leos, and Sagittarius. Okay, so let's see we have one down right here. Happy birthday to the sign of Leo. I really do hope that you are enjoying your birthday. But let's see what we got going on here. This is the next 48 hours right here. This is for Leos, Aries, and Sagittarius right here. Wow, okay. Ace of Pentacles right here, the Nine of Cups. You're going to get a new start. Yeah, you're getting some type of new start right here. I'm getting like, it's blessed, I feel. The Nine of Cups, it's like something is wish fulfillment, I feel. Okay, and you're going to get a new start. Maybe it's something to do with an earth sign or an earth sign, um, in an earth sign season or something. Okay, well, this is something that's grounding you right now because you're going to get a new start. Okay. I feel like you're about to start some type of new foundation right here, I feel. Yeah, it says the power of all uh, earth signs. So it could be earth sign or in the earth sign season. Or this is grounding you. Because I kind of feel like something here is for fulfillment. Okay, what's the message right here, please? Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. So I feel like you're going to see some results to something right here. Seven of Pentacles is seeing some results. Okay. Um, I feel like something here is long term too. So whatever you're starting right here, it's going to be wish fulfillment. It's going to be long term, I feel, in some way. Okay. Yeah, the death card right here. Something ending. You get to get a new beginning, I feel, right here. Okay, the eight of pentacles. Okay. The tower is reversed. Wow, okay. This one right here is the page of pentacles right there. All right, let me see. Message right here, please. Fire sign. So whatever is about to start or happen for you, it is extreme. I'm getting like... It's extreme with fulfillment. Okay. It is really extreme. I'm getting over here. Okay. The Empress. Wow. Something here is definitely about to change with the divine feminine energy for some people on here. Okay. Look at that. Victory and success. Wow. I feel like something here is going to be extremely wish fulfillment in some way right here. Life is going to be good for somebody right here. It, it could be like extreme change in some way, okay? Because we had a tower and a death, so something is extreme. I'm getting right here, okay? So the Eight of Pentacles right here and the Ace of Pentacles. So I feel like you're going to have a new beginning because you was consistent, because you was dedicated, because you mastered the fact right here that I'm going to have this new beginning in some type of way. I feel like something here took hard work. For you to be focused or something like that, I feel for some of you right here. But this Ace of Pentacles, it could be. Let me just say this, okay? Because the Ace of Pentacles in your reading, especially with the Tower Reverse and the Nine of Cups, something here could be extreme wish fulfillment. Now, I don't know if this is a lottery because sometimes Ace of Pentacles could be a lottery ticket. If it is, I feel like that, um, you know, if if you have an extra dollar or two, right, and the Ace of Pentacles here with the Tower Reverse and Nine of Cups, I would definitely get a lottery ticket. Um... But that's only if you have an extra dollar or two. You don't need to spend the whole bank to win. If you're going to win, you're going to win, right? So that's one thing, all right? But let me see here. Ace of Pentacles right here, Eight of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles right here and the Eight of Pentacles. This is fire. Aries, Leos, and Sagittarius right here. Look at that, the devil card. Mm, okay, could be a Capricorn right here. Eight of Wands right here, okay. So these two eights right here. Hmm. So here's what I'm kind of getting for some of you. Have you already been playing the lottery? That's another way it could be. Some of you could have been already playing the lottery right here. All right. And with a devil card right here, it also could say that some of you, maybe you're overdoing it. Could be the case too for some people here. So that's another thing I'm getting right here. All right. Because the devil card is here and these two eights. Okay. So two eights is watching your money. Right. Could be the case. Let's see what this is saying here, okay? So this is fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Wow. Let me see what I'm getting right here. Because it also could be right here, okay? Somebody, right, is watching your money. Huh. Okay, the emperor and the devil could be. 
maybe somebody else is over here watching your money could be the case this also could represent a narcissist maybe somebody here is a narcissist could be a capricorn or an aries or anybody else it could be i have a leo down here so it could be anybody at all you know what i mean but the sun card i feel like something here is going to reveal i feel like somebody's sitting over here watching your money for some people right here and i do feel like they are okay because the ten of pentacles right here and the ace of pentacles so this is money right here okay i feel like with these two eight somebody's watching it i feel for some people right here and look another thing right here i got the ace of cups and a ten of cups too ace of cups ten of cups being completely happy ace of cups i mean ace of pentacles ten of pentacles financially secured right here okay so i feel like you're going to get a new start you're going to be happy okay i feel like that you are going to be financially secured in some way you may even get a new house over here however somebody over here is watching it i feel right here with the devil and the emperor okay or somebody's upset because you're watching your money did you already hit the lottery or what okay what's going on here <laughs> the emperor and the devil yeah look at that somebody's obsessed i'm getting right here with watching your money or something like that yeah i feel like they are obsessed over here with watching your money wow unbelievable or watching you or something like that they even could be obsessed with sex this one right here okay it could be they could be obsessed with sex they could be obsessed with watching your money or something like that right here with these three they definitely could be lusting too hard i'm getting right here with the lovers right there and the devil they could be lusting hard maybe they want to control sex or something i feel like somebody has a sex addiction i feel over here for some people here okay i feel like that's revealed okay and i feel like that freaks them out for some people right here they have a sex addiction okay the nine of swords right here and the seven of swords okay but something more is going on over here i feel okay something is about pen all right playing the lottery okay but let me see anything else over here let me see the moon card is reversed you're not in some illusion they're narcissists or they're obsessed with you or something or your money or something like that yeah they feel foolish right here something they with something they doing over here is unbelievable i'm getting a sense right here okay i'm like they're all the way obsessed with you i'm getting for some people here take a resonate leave the rest but they're obsessed right here with you somebody is okay definitely could be an aries okay um a gemini a capricorn leo aries i said they're already pisces and cancer right here okay so i just feel like you're not in some illusion right here this person be watching your money or watching you or spying on you something like that okay i feel like they're heartbroken i feel like some mask has really came off about this person over here i feel okay the fool right here and the four cups right here you know or they could feel like you're the lottery ticket or something but okay i'm getting like wow i feel like this person's obsessed right here either with you or they have been lusting about people or whatever i feel like right here somebody's not in no illusion right here the moon car reverse they're not in illusion anymore and that's the fool that's like it's unexpected to them that something they're doing over here is definitely revealed i feel okay it could be something revealed about who their lover is or something about sex over here could be significant too and they're heartbroken right here and you can see them that's what I gotta get here. You can see them. Somebody right here. Okay. All right. So we had a tower in reverse and a nine of cups. This is like extreme wish fulfillment. Something here is extremely wish fulfillment. I feel in some way. Okay. Maybe you even won the lottery and then you realize somebody over here was obsessed or whatever they was doing to somebody's money or whatever. Something like that. What's the tower reverse? Okay. Hmm. They wasn't being realistic about something in some way okay i'm getting like life is extremely good with you or is going to be for some people right here okay um somebody's realizing that right here okay judgment they realize that life is extremely good right here with you okay but some people somebody does not have a chance could be a narcissist over here they have not one chance in hell i'm here right here to be over here in this wish fulfillment energy over here with you or something like that okay 
Yeah, because I feel like some money is good. Well, it's going to be good. King of Pentacles right here. This even could be somebody did not have no idea that you was going to hit the lottery or that you was wish fulfillment in general, okay? They had no idea something like that, okay? I feel like they didn't. In the future, they had no idea that either you could see the future or that something was great right here with you in the future, I feel, okay? Because I feel like somebody over here is spying on you, all right? And they're seeing you living your best life. The Ten of Cups and the Ace of Cups, they're going to see you live your best life. I'm mean, like, you're going to be completely happy for somebody right here, okay? Money, it is coming your way if it's not already here. But for some of you, this money is coming. I'm getting right here. It's coming. Oh, it's already here. Somebody's going to see you. They even see you already living your best life right here. Happy, fulfilled, okay? Even could be financially. You're not in any kind of illusion. They're heartbroken over here. They was lusting or they're obsessed with you or whatever, okay? Life is good. They didn't see that life is going to be this great. I'm getting like, it's going to be so freaking great. I'm getting like, it's so great, okay? What's the tower right here, reverse? All right. Yeah, when they contemplate about something, it's great. Okay, it might even affect them or their health for some people right here. How great something here is. Okay. For some of you, I feel like it's going to be an earth sign season. Okay, so the next one is coming up is Virgo, but then we have Capricorn season or something like that. Okay, some house is going to be miraculous or it is or something like that. Okay. Yeah, and it's just like something is... I'm getting like whatever fate, a kiss of fate that blows over here to you that is extremely wish fulfillment. It is extreme wish fulfillment right here for somebody right here. Okay. Somebody took their mask off or something like that or see them. Okay. <laughs> the truth. Okay. That they've been deceptive about something right here. It could be in a marriage, it could be a house or anything else. It could be a bank, something like that. Okay. Religion. They would be deceptive. And I'm getting like something is extremely going to be great and awesome for you in some way. Extreme. So the seven of pentacles right here and the page of pentacles right here. I'm getting like you're going to see results and money in some way. Some way you're going to see it. In some kind of way, you're going to see this results right here in money. Seven of Pentacles right here in the Page of Pentacles. That's the truth. Somebody's going to spy on you and see it. I'm getting right here, right? And that is the truth right here. I'm getting like, wow. Somebody that's seeing you is powerless. They can't do nothing but see you and just look at you. Live in your beautiful house or something like that. Okay? Yes. Okay, somebody also could be confused right here. And how do you know the truth about something right here? They even could be stuck because of, because of Aquarius, a Libra, or a Gemini in some way. Could be the case. Something about them could be significant. Or this could be Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Yeah, yeah. Getting some money from somebody over here is hopeless. It's all the way hopeless right here. Okay, because even they was enabling over here this narcissist. Okay, or something like that. Or they could make a decision for the narcissist or whatever they was doing over here. Okay, I feel like, or they could have been lusting, or they lusting over you, or they're obsessed with you, or whatever, right? They're gonna be heartbroken right here. They're gonna be heartbroken. I'm getting right here. It's hopeless getting any money from you for some people right here. All they could do is sit right here and spy on you and look at you, get money, or something like that. Like, that's the truth. And something here is extreme blessings right there with a the tower and a nine of cups. It's extreme blessings coming to somebody right here. They go spy on you, but that's about all they could do. I'm getting right here. They can't get any money. Some people, it's hopeless getting some money for some people right here. I'm getting right here. Yeah, and that's fate. Okay, like something here is faded right here. You're going to get a new beginning. You're going to travel. That's fate. You're going to do that. Okay. For some of you, something ended. Could be with a twin flame or a mother or whoever else it was right here. Okay, a Scorpio, Taurus, or Libra, maybe. Okay. Something's about to change with you in some way. I'm getting right here. Yeah. Wow. 
some of you you're consciously aware about a mother so something could be ended with the father or whatever but you're consciously aware about something of you somebody's consciously aware right here it could be this aries leo sagittarius or a gemini or the virgo they're consciously aware okay they even could be consciously aware about a magic spell but they're definitely consciously aware about something right here okay something here is too hard somebody make a clear decision about something it's too hard for somebody to do something right here okay if they was enabling the narcissist, somebody's consciously aware they're enabling the narcissist for some people right here. Okay, I feel like something here is going to be heavy on them if you travel or if you leave or something like that. Okay, this here could be somebody at a distance. Okay, somebody's going to be stuck right here because I feel like your inner strength is so freaking strong right here. I'm getting right here. Okay, your inner strength is strong. Somebody know you know the truth about something, you're consciously aware. Some of you, you're traveling, I'm getting right here, okay? Um, this could be a Sagittarius that we're talking about right here. Or this could be right here. Somebody did want to reconcile with you, but I'm getting like, either you're aware of something right here they was doing, whatever this is right here, they was doing something over here out of control, I'm getting right here. They could be left out in the cold in some way, I feel, right? Yeah, and they could be missing your energy. They could be wanting to reconcile right here with you right here for some people here. But something was going on over here that they heartbroken about. Okay. Right here, these ones right here. Either they was enabling a narcissist that I'm not sure if they was enabling a narcissist right here that was had a sex addiction. Maybe that narcissist they was enabling have a sex addiction. They was enabling them. They heartbroken over here now. They was enabling this narcissist over here to have a sex addiction for some people right here. Right? Right? Because it could be revealed to them right now. That that person has sex addiction right here, right? Or there's something more was going on with them. That's revealed to them I'm get for some people right here, okay? And I feel like they they feel like that because I missed opportunity with you now or something like that. All right, so that's what it could be. It could be they was obsessed with you. Let me get one more right here. This emperor and the devil right here. The emperor, the devil, and the lover's part. What is that? page of wands right here i feel like you was curious and you could have found out something about over this over here about this narcissist in some way okay whatever's going on is karma it's karma right here okay it's a cause and effect for enabling the narcissist or this is the narcissist or whatever or lusting something like that okay anyway this is what i have for you right now thank you so much for taking a look here i say you all peace blessings love and lights and i'm a state to all of you